All right, today we're going to learn about a high duct static uh, pressure switch here, or cutout, I should say. Um, right now I have the wires on the common and normally close, so without this being tripped, we're going to have continuity going through here. So in order to test this properly, we have to have a magnet helic gauge and usually like one of these little medicine balls. These are on Amazon, you can get them for like 8 or $9, and um, this will help you tell when this thing is tripped here. So what I'm going to do is pump this up and find the trip point for this. Uh, high duct static cutout. As you can see, it was about like 1.9 is what this thing tripped at. And if you'll notice, we'll go back to the uh, switch over here. We shouldn't have any continuity. It should be open now because it's tripped. As you can see, we don't have that. And now we're, I'm going to reset the switch and now we should have our continuity back. If you need to make an adjustment to either increase it or decrease it, you could go to the back here and turn this screw either clockwise or counterclockwise to increase or, um, the pressure, if not decrease it, for the trip point on here. And um, you had your two wires here. This would go on the UC600 as one of the UIs because this is a binary input is what this point would be on the uh, UC600 here. Um, hope that helped you out and have a good day.